right. All right. Ninja maniacs. So l- let me say this at the very beginning. For those of you that have subscribed for years, you follow me. You've heard me talk about what I'm about to train on, but I've never trained at the level I'm going to give you. As a matter of fact, I put several videos like this in the past that got a lot of views, thousands, and YouTube took it down. Rightfully so, right? I was so excited to share with you a direct mail postcard marketing platform. And I want you to understand what I just said, direct mail and postcard, because I'm going to show you something in a minute, kind of divert for just a minute to share with you why it's important when you do marketing that you target market and not just blanket market. So hold with me on that. Stay with me because I'm gonna show something to you in a minute. It's gonna blow you away. Uh, But back to this, (laughs) I was putting videos out there showing some phenomenal direct mail strategies, but in the process of showing how to find leads to send your direct mail to slash postcards, I was including personal information and that's a big no-no. So today I'm going to do the same stinking thing, but I'm going to blur out all personal information. We are not sharing anybody's emails, none of that. But I want to share with you why your direct mail slash postcard marketing isn't working. And I'm going to show with you something we spent tens of thousands of dollars on, probably over 100,000 at this point to perfect, right? I'm going to show you something you haven't seen. I have gone on YouTube, guys, and I've looked at what the gurus are teaching and coaching. And what you're going to get from me is not just a bunch of fluff and gruff. I'm going to show you real life examples. I'm going to show you what we send. And then if you'll hang with me at the end, I'm going to give you a special incentive. No, not a free trial. And I'm going to give you a special incentive. It's literally a business in a box if you want to do direct mail slash postcard marketing. Now, let me say this before I show you a really interesting um, uh, strategy, or actually, uh, I want to coach you on why target marketing is so crucial that you get it right. Um, But let me say this. If you are a real estate agent, there are, actually, if you're an entrepreneur or business owner, there are two things you have got to get right in 2023 moving forward because the marketing landscape has changed. You've got to get your direct mail slash postcard marketing on point, on game. You can't do your grandma's postcard and direct mail marketing. It ain't going to work. And if you're sending out postcards with home evaluation links, stop the insanity. Quit doing it. You're you're losing money. Nobody cares about you or your message. And if you're putting a big picture of you on the card, stop the insanity. Ain't nobody care if even holy crap. Let me give you a, let me give you a quick example. Uh about a year ago I got a, a postcard from a, a real estate agent locally. And it was a little <laughs> tiny one, like smaller than a four by six. Um <laughs> and it was basically a home evaluation. Hey, and the Funny thing is the back of the card was totally white. There was nothing on the back. It was just the front. And the biggest marketing tool that this agent used was a picture of her on the front of the card, full body picture, beautiful, blonde hair, blue eyed. I mean, we're talking like this real estate agent. If we had a contest in Claremont, Florida, in Lake County, Florida, she would win as the most beautiful agent in the world, right? Here's why I would never use her. As soon as I showed that to my wife, my wife would be, "Uh uh-uh. Go find you. If you want a lady to sell our home, go find one that's 60, right? Weighs about 400 pounds. <laughs> I'm, I'm, being, I'm making a joke here, guys. But for God's sake, please take your face off that card. It's okay to put your branding on there, right? Uh, but you need to start doing direct mail where it's educational-based marketing. Here's a little tip. We're going to get into this in a minute. And you need to use video. You need to send people to video to educate them on you, the market, and the topic at hand. We'll get into that in just a minute. So again, just a little tip, but let me share my screen. And I wanna show you, um, I wanna show you why targeted marketing with postcards is so dadgum important. Why you don't just send a postcard to everybody, right? You gotta target that postcard to the highest intent client to see higher conversions. Now, let me say this too, before I show you my screen, I keep saying that, but stuff just keeps popping up. Guys, I I do, I have, I get Zillow leads. I get, um, I do pay-per-click. I haven't done pay-per-click in a while, but I do pay-per-click. I'm currently running a Facebook uh, uh, ad right now on a, on a listing of mine, generated about 14 leads so far at about $1.90 a lead, phone numbers, emails, which is great, right? But none of them have responded back to me. And I've got great email funnels, direct mail funnels. I've got um, uh, video email funnels. I mean, you name it, we've got it, right? 
And so when you are thinking of generating leads, and I'm not telling you not to do Facebook leads, please understand that that is right down there with the low hanging fruit leads. Um, you're going to have to generate a lot of these leads to find one. Same thing with cold calling, right? Not against it. I just don't do it. This homie don't do cold calling anymore, right? I'm just tired of the abuse. And quite frankly, I am tired of getting freaking cold called myself by everybody selling me NAR insurance, right? You get them, uh, you know, uh, lead generation companies. And they all are from somewhere not in the United States. That's how you know it's a sales call, right? I just click. Um, so, I mean, if you're cold calling, great. There's a lot of gurus on, on uh, YouTube that are going to tell you about cold calling. You're not going to get that here on this channel, right? We want to concentrate on making real estate great again, right? In other words, we want people calling you that are high intent clients, not the other way around. Because at the end of the day, your psychological health depends on you enjoying real estate. How many of you right now absolutely hate real estate? You dread it. You've got your license. You haven't closed a lot of deals. You go, you're at a brick and mortar store where you go in the office and usually there's 12 or 13 agents there that aren't selling anything. And you guys get coffee and you talk about how bad the real estate market is, right? If that's you, get out of that toxic environment and start thinking about how you want to structure your business. All right. That's a whole nother video. Let me share my screen now. And I want to show you why targeted marketing is how you're going to dominate. Oh, and by the way, the two things, you can tell I've got ADD, are direct mail, targeted, and YouTube GeoFarm channel. That's where you create a YouTube channel for your business locally and you start educating people on your market. Not going to talk about that today, but I am going to go heavy on this channel on YouTube channel build out, how to do it successfully. And guys, I'm not the originator. I learn from some of the best and I disseminate that information to you guys. Um, and then direct mail. So those are the two. But right here, guys, and is an I is an understanding of why um it's very important for you guys that when you are creating your campaigns, you are making sure that your marketing is based on what people are looking for. Um, believe it or not, as the ninja marketing expert here, I just discovered this today and I'm pissed at myself. I've been doing a lot of my videos on my YouTube channel for you agents called direct mail marketing, best direct mail marketing, five direct mail marketing pieces you need to send, you know, direct mail this, blah, 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 right? Well, guys, look at this. I went ahead and did a keyword search on YouTube for direct mail for realtors. You'd think that would be like, oh my God, all, you know, realtors want to know about direct mail. 110 searches a month on YouTube. This explosion just went off in my head. I'm like, holy crap, I've been optimizing for 100, insert cuss word, searches a month. How stupid is that? It's the same thing when you're sending direct mail. This is why I don't direct mail an entire geographical location, which is expensive. I'm going to go out and use software, which I'm going to show you in a minute, on how to target people that predictively will be selling in the next 12 months, right? Huge difference, lower budget, less stress. And you're only dealing with people that predictably are going to be dealing with an agent. And then once you tag into that stream, you can scale it at scale. Uh, we'll get into that in a minute. But here's direct mail for realtors. And then you guys, you can see the videos, right? Here's the videos. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba, direct mail free course. Boom. There's Michael Reese. Love you, Michael. If you ever see this video, you're, 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 you're the GOAT. Uh, become known in your area. Direct mail isn't dead, right? 400 views. Um, 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 5,000 views, but look, 400 views, he's got 700 subs. So that's normal. That's actually a good return. Half of his subs have viewed it, right? Here's 5,000 views with 34,000 subs. I mean, if, if we were statistically the same, he should have, um, you know, this guy just put it out three weeks ago and got half his subs watching it. Uh, and I love Kyle Handy, but guys, you can see what I'm talking about. Here's Michael Reese, 10,000 views with 3,000 subs. He, that's why he's the GOAT. He's, it is two years old, uh, but man, look at that. But again, direct mailers for realtors, 100 per month. So if we just change it, and remember, there's a difference between the word direct mail and postcard. I'm now switching it to postcard marketing. Direct mail can also include handwritten letters, right? I want to talk about postcard marketing, automation targeted. So when I change the keyword, guys, to postcard for realtors, Look at the search volume, 880 a month, 800. And if I drop the word postcard, uh, postcard for realtors and just do postcards, 
Let's see if we can get a new one here. Oh, it just came back postcard. Point is, I went from 100 searches a month to 880 searches a month, right? I just think that's very powerful. Eight times the amount of searches just by changing strategically the um, the keyword that you're going to use. Same thing with your postcards. When you're sending out direct mail postcards, you've got to target the most strategic people that are going to look at your message, right? So let now I'm going to show you where I get my leads, right? And again, I've done Zillow, I've Facebook, I'm running Facebook now. This is one of the, this and your YouTube channel have the highest conversions I have seen in 15 years. So let me share my screen again. I use a company called my plus leads. And if you guys want to get a 30 day free trial of what I'm showing, you, just go to myplusninja.com and get the package that has the neighborhood data, the FISBOs and expireds. If you want to jump to their top package, it also includes pre foreclosures. Guys, you'll have more leads than you can shake a stick at, right? So here's an example, guys. <clears throat> Today I have three FISBOs and 18 expireds, no pre foreclosures. <clears throat> Yesterday, one and seven. The day before, 10. Let me show more. The day before, two and 17. But looky here, three days ago, 13. Actually, four days ago, 13 pre foreclosures. So guys, in a given week, I will have somewhere around 75 to 100 possible leads. Now, what makes these leads so powerful? And we are going to get to the postcard in a minute, but I'm going to get the, all their information, their phone numbers, their emails, right? So now here's where I'm going to actually show you the leads. I'm going to blur out on my screen their contact information because I don't want you to, to have it. And I don't want, I don't want YouTube to, um, to, to get rid of this video because I'm not sharing personal information. But guys, if I log in here to, to, to the first one, so today there's three FISBOs. What you can't see is over here, over here, if you can see that when I blur it, there's their phone number and email. Over here's the address. So I've got address, name, phone number, and email right there. What can I do with that? I can email them. My name is, how are you doing, right? Looks like you're selling your home on your own without a realtor. Congrats. I think you should try and do it. Here's what I'd like to say to you. As long as you're selling your home for sale by owner without a realtor, consider me your secret agent. I've got a lot of great tools that I would love to give you. These are going to help you compete against homes listed near you by agents. And they will drive more buyers to your home. You do not have to list with me for my help. Consider this my free gift to you. I hope everything goes good on the sale of your home. Contact information is below. If you'd like a free website, some free color flyers, if you want some buyer leads for your home, go ahead and reach out to me. My promise, I'm never going to ask you to list your home with me. If you decide to list with a realtor and you like what I do, just simply call me. Otherwise, I'm here to help. Thank you. Have a great day. Guys, you need to pause this video, scroll back to what I just did, or go to the transcript, the three dots underneath me, go to the transcript and grab that transcript of what I just said. Make that an email. Take that content and break it apart and put it for your direct mail, <laughs> right? Your postcards. I mean, it was worth the price of this video just for that. I'm sorry, but it was. So now that I've got this data, before I go into, and there's some other stuff on here I'm going to show you, but before I get there, now that you got the data, what are you going to do with it? So here is a company that I use, preach and teach. I have used send out cards, thanks.io. I've used uh, four or five other companies where you can log on and create a card and they'll ship them to you and you can give them to the post office. And guys, I've used it all, right? This company for years now has been my go-to direct mailer because I automate everything. All the cards are done for me. And as a bonus, not only did in the last seven or eight months, I actually uh, had the opportunity to deal with their dev team. We've created as a partnership with me, the ability to instantly put the Google street image of that client's home on their card like that. And now depending on the level you get, if you come on board with them, I'm a, I'm, I use executive level because I get a lot of free cards, like unlimited free cards but it also has a trackable QR code. So now when I send somebody a card, they scan that QR code, I'm instantly notified by text or email that Jim Smith at 123 Granite Bay just scans your card. It's the second one in your GeoFarm series. Here's his phone number, here's his email. Boom.
I told you this was not your grandma's postcard company, right? So I'm not going to go through a complete demo of the system. And by the way, look below in the uh, description. I will give you a link that will give you a massive discount. When you sign up, I'm going to know because guess what? I'm going to get an email and I'm going to get a text. Hey, Kelly, Barbara Stanwick at Hoopy Doopyville just signed up with a pro or executive level. Say hi to him. I'm going to send you an email with a massive amount of training and kicker. All of the cards that I've created, I've spent thousands on. You're going to get them for free. I'm going to show you how to upload them into your account. I'm going to show you how to edit them. And then I'm going to show you what to freaking do to get them sent out to the right clients. Guys, this is a business in a box, right? So when you first get your dashboard, the video is going to tell you to watch the uh, or the onboarding. And those of you uh, that are at big real estate companies, you know what onboarding means. There's a complete done for, like this is where you're going to go when you first sign up. And I want you to watch all of that. And you're also going to have my onboarding. And this is going to make you a ninja postcard uh, Jedi master. Is that even possible? I think a ninja postcard Jedi master is stronger than a Jedi master. But anyway, I digress. So here is the bonuses, guys. This is my saved automation. And I want to show you just a little bit of what I'm talking about. So here is my FISBO campaigns. Now, I'm not going to go through every all the 50 plus cards I'm going to give you. But here's an example, guys. Here's the front. This is why my cards are so dadgum powerful. I want you to look at this. It's going to insert the first name of that client you bring over. So, Bob, here are a few for sale by owner ninja tips to help you make more money. There's an image of his home that's automatic. I don't have to do it, guys. It's going to automatically pull a street view of his house. If your home is priced right, you will get more money. If it's priced too high or too low, you will always lose money. Here's a couple of suggestions. Price it correctly. Strategically priced for your location. Price per square foot is not a good strategy. Scan the QR code. When they scan it, guess what? It's a video of me. Hey, guys, thank you for scanning the QR code. By now, you know and I know that you're selling your house without a realtor. Congratulations. I think you should. Now, this market is tough. Interest rates are high, so it's going to be a little bit of a challenge. So what I want to do is share a couple really cool tips for you guys to make sure that your home is optimized to get a lot of buyers. And then I'm going to take six to eight minutes to educate them on pricing. At the very end, I'm going to say, now guys, uh, below this video, because I, I send them to a video funnel, below this video, and I'll even give you that information, below this video, guys, is um, um, a button that will say, get Kelly's free tools or whatever. When they scan it, I'm going to get their information. I'm going to give them a website and all of the goodies that I told them about in the video. And I haven't asked them net one to list their home with me. Now, some of you gurus are watching this going, oh my God, Kelly, well, yeah, it's a, you're, yours is kind of like, no, I'm going to let you guys piss off these people for the first 30 to 40 days. I'm going to let you guys get abused by them because you're trying to list their home and they just listed it themselves. I'm going to let you do all of that so that when and if they decide to list their home with me, they're going to remember me because I'm the only agent that gave them what I gave them. And number two, I always say in my video on every card, and guys, if you end up selling your home, let me know if you're not working with an agent right now and you're buying another home, guys, you don't have to do what I'm about to tell you, but this is what I do. If you're buying another home, reach out, get on my calendar. Let's do a quick Zoom. I would love to share with you what I do for the buyers I represent. The biggest thing is I want to help you guys with some closing costs. I have a 25% buyer's agent commission rebate. I will gift it to you. You can use it for closing costs. Now, obviously, you might be in a state that doesn't allow that. So you have to figure that out. Check with your broker. Check with your local uh, 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 state rules regarding what you can and can't do. But if you can, what a killer offer, right? If I can't get their listing, man, I want to work with them as a buyer's agent. And guys, if they scan that and reach back out to me, that's an inbound call. But that is not your grandma's FISBO card. And let's look at the next one. Here's the next one. I'm not going to read it. This one's about presentation. This one's about uh, preparing your home. This one is why Zillow's not your friend. And guys, these cards are going out to them about every two to three days. Here's the next one. The majority of home buyers are working with realtors who typically will not show them a for sale by owner property. I can change that immediately. Scan the code to see. This is where I'm going to say, hey, guys, you've been a for sale by owner now for uh, two to five weeks. Just wanted to check in and see how the journey's going. Don't forget, below the card is my phone number. You can call or text me at 407, blah, 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 blah. Uh, just wanted to touch base and find out if how the experience is going. And if and when you're ready to talk to a realtor, I would love to share with you what we do to market and sell our homes. It's unique. It's one of a kind. And there's no other agent in town that does what we do. 
right? Look forward to talking with you. Let me know what, that's the QR code, right? So let's go ahead and stop sharing that. That's my FISBO program, guys. Let's go back to the, and you get all of that. You, all of that's editable too. Um, by the way, I also am going to give you all of my video scripts for these cards. You just have to record them on your computer. Change my name. Hello, this is Billy Bob, right? Just read my script in a teleprompter. Now you got the video. Oh my God, this is so killer. Here's my geo farm. Check this out, guys. Very unique cards. First card, I send them a little bit about me. Hey, Bob, thinking about selling your home at one, two, three Granite Bay for the most money possible. Recent sold homes by the Ninja. There's a QR code. I'm just going to introduce myself. Here's sold home. These are homes that I listed and sold or buyers that I worked with. Right now, if you don't have at least nine, go to your broker and see if you can borrow nine of his past sales because the broker owns the listing. If the broker gives you permission or go to the agent to, to allow you to market in your geographical farm using the broker sold listings, then just get him to send you a picture of the home with permission and boom, you trade out these pictures for what the broker gives you, right? So there's the first card. By the way, on the back of the card, I'm not going to show it to you, but it is chock full of crazy information and call to actions. All of it editable. Promotion, preparation. This Now, these cards for GeoFarm go out once a month, right? And they're all done to give video education. Nowhere on here is it going to ask them to click a link for a home value. Look at this one. Julie, thinking about selling your home at 123 Granite Bay for the most money possible? A strategy called MLS pricing can sell your home faster and get more money. Here's a picture of Julie's home. Scan the QR code to see how you strategy like this to make more money. They scan it. It's a video of me. There it is, guys. There's another one. There's another one. So let's get out of here. That is my uh, GeoFarm for seller card, right? Then I have uh, a cash offer card. Okay, here's my cash offer. Here's the first one. All of these cards you get, guys, I'm giving you these cards. They are yours if you decide to go this route with direct mail. Uh, there's my pre-foreclosure cards. Let's go ahead and just look at these really quick. And I've got expireds and I've got probate cards to give you. I also have cash offer cards. I have um, a home partner. If you're using home partners in your area, I've already got cards for you on that. That's the least to own. So here are my foreclosure cards. These cards are amazing, guys. On the back of these cards, I have the QR code with a video. Right. So let's now talk about the fact that these are not normal, traditional direct mail or postcards. These are we've spent thousands of dollars and A-B tested these. And these are the cards that I'm going with right now because they are working, not just for me, but the hundreds of agents that follow me and use this program and use my cards. Again, they're editable. Um, you can, uh, and you guys, pardon, pardon me for, um, man, I am just drenched in sweat. My air conditioner went out yesterday. They're coming today. So pray for the Ninja. They're coming today to fix it. Um, but anyway, <laughs> I've wanted to get this video out. So air conditioner or not, we going with this, right? Homies, we are going with this training. Um, now let's talk about automating the entire process. So as I said at the beginning, two things you need to focus in on as an agent this year are your GeoFarm YouTube channel, which I'm going to train you on this. Make sure you hit subscribe and the bell. I'm training on this subject, guys, the rest of this year. I'm going to show you how to dominate your market with YouTube. Also direct mail at a high level. So now you got all my cards. Now what? Where do you freaking get your leads, right? Back to my plus leads. And I'm going to show you guys. So what I did earlier is I showed you how you can log in every day and get FISBOs and expired. So I'm going to show you live right now how I do this. So I'm going to log back into FISBOs. I'm going to blur out the data. So you're not going to get the phone. You're not going to get it. Just trust me, there are three FISBOs here. And I'm going to reach out to all three of these, right? So what I do, and again, since it's blurred, you're not going to be able to see it. But I'm going to click. And I'm going to select all of them. Okay. And then I'm going to come up here. And I'm going to export. I'm sorry, guys. I'm going to sync them to Mailbox Power. And let me stop right there. If you can't see it because it's grayed out, I have, after speaking with the owner of My Plus Leads, I got him to integrate his system to Mailbox Power. What does that mean? You log in, you click the lead you want, and it automatically sends them as a group to Mailbox Power. Then when you get to Mailbox Power, I'll show it to you in a minute. You simply click it and you start that automation like that. Right. So I'm going to sync these with Mailbox Power. 
I'm going to call this FISBO and today's date, 7 18, 23. The reason I'm doing that, guys, is when I go back into my uh, contact list at Mailbox Power, I want to pull up my FISBOs by dates so I know what's going on with them, right? So I'm going to submit it, proceed, and now I'm syncing all. So what Mailbox Power is going to do in a second is they're going to get my plus leads, set, and it's done. It's now done. So let me go back to Mailbox Power, right? And I'm going to go to Contacts. Guys, there's nothing else like what I'm showing you, right? I'm going to go to all contacts. I'm going to go to FISBO. There it is, guys, 7-18-23. Now, I'm going to go ahead and blur out these leads because, again, I do not want you guys to have access to their information. But trust me when I, sh when I tell you this, if it's blurred out, I'm going to click this button. I'm going to enroll them in automation. It's going to ask me what. I'm going to go to my FISBO Prime. I'm going to click it, and if I hit Add to Automation, which I'm going to do right now, I'm going to add it. Done. Guys, let me tell you how powerful that is that I just showed you. I just, in under a minute, started a five-week direct mail postcard targeted automation with cards that are educating and gift-giving to the end user, not begging for them, and I'm done. I don't have to do anything now. They're going to get my cards. Possibly one of these are going to call me. Imagine doing that every day. Like you're over there now going, okay, where am I going to get my leads? I need some leads for my business. Boy, it's getting hot here, guys. <laughs> I need leads for my business. What am I going to do? Oh my God, I, I need leads. I need. I just showed you right there. Ah, it gets better. Now I'm going to show you the game changer. So let me go back to sharing my screen. And I don't know anybody that's about to do what I'm going to show you. So let me go back to my dashboard. Again, I'm wiping all of that out because I don't want you to see it. But let's go ahead now. And let's talk about the game changer. Now, remember, on this data, I'll get FISBOs, expires, and pre-foreclosures every day. So I, depending on my budget, I can send as many, I can automate, like within minutes, I can automate as many leads as I want to send my message to. But let's go back to GeoFarm. My Plus Leads has the ability for me to generate, let me get rid of this, data on where I live. So just so you guys know, I live here in Claremont, Florida. Here's Orlando. Here's uh, Disney World, Lake Buena Vista, SeaWorld, Universal. I'm about 25 miles outside of Orlando, 20 minutes to 25 minutes outside of Disney, um, Leesburg, and then the Villages, which is the largest 55 plus. I'm 30 minutes from that. So I have got a freaking phenomenal area in Central Florida that I can farm, right? So what I'm going to do is show you a strategy that nobody is talking about, nobody on YouTube, and I'm giving it to you raw here. And this is why... This ain't your grandma's postcard campaigns. This is targeted at a extreme high level. Most of you are not even going to believe what I'm about to show you, but it's for real. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here and I'm going to draw out an area in Claremont. Okay, so that little area, there's 25,000. You know what? I'm going to get rid of that. Let's do something. That's too much. I want to make this practical. So let's go back in and let's draw. This is really where I like to work. Okay, so there's 3,400 people in that block, 3,400 addresses. If I go down here and I get rid of absentee homeowners, it's going to bring it to 24. Now, here's where, here's where the magic happens. These are homeowners. The software has already scanned that area, and it's taken into consideration everybody that sold their home in the last 12 months. And using big data, the software knows what the people that sold in the last 12 months, what they were looking at online, like realtor.com, Zillow, mortgage companies, real estate websites, keyword searches, like what's my home worth, right? So of the 2,500 people there, I only want the people in this area that currently live there that are searching for the same websites and keyword searches as the people that sold in the last 12 months. I don't know if you guys understand what I'm saying, but watch this, guys. 160. In that area, there are 160 people I could market to out of 2,400 that have the that are currently looking at Zillow, Realtor, mortgage companies, real estate agents, websites, keying in searches like "What's my home worth? What's the best realtor?" Do y'all do y'all understand that? 160 people. That's going to run me roughly. 
about $48 a month to send everybody on that list one card a month. If these are the highest intent sellers in your farm, your conversions on these go, go through the roof. So let's just say you converted 5%, right? 5%. Let's bring up trusty dusty calculator. Let's clear it. Let's go 160 people and 5% in the next 12 months you can convert. That's eight deals times an average of 10,000 on commissions. That's 80 grand. Now, oh, let me bring back the calculator because here is the kicker. That's $80,000, guys, 80,000. But if 160 people cost me 47 a month times 12, it's going to cost me $564 in postage. The cards are free. $500 in postage to market to those high intent sellers. Now, what's really cool about it? I'm going to generate the list. Now, guys, I'm going to blur this out. It's searching. I'm going to blur this out. But if I go ahead and select all, here's what My Plus Leads is going to do. Remember, you can get a 30-day trial of this. Just go to myplusninja.com and register. But guys, if I hit that word augment, it's going to give me 85 to 90% of all of these homeowners' phone numbers and emails. Did y'all hear what I just said? And now if I want to go ahead and export, I'm sorry, to sync this, I can sync this list to Mailbox Power, phone numbers and emails. I'm not going to do it right now because I get a thousand of these a month. I'm about to go ahead and go to my next geofarm area and extract a thousand home sellers. My goal is to get 6,000 in the next six months. And now I've got a list that I can market to by email. I can upload those to Facebook as a custom audience and run a four, semi per click, four pennies per click video view. I can take that list of 6,000 and send them to my YouTube channel for Claremont and provoke them to subscribe. Guys, the marketing you get from this is crazy. Like, like Facebook ads that are four cent a click because they're video ads, uh, direct mail going to the highest intent people, email campaigns, right? Sending them an email and a direct uh, and a Facebook ad that just simply says, Hey, my name is, I've got one of the best uh, uh, YouTube channels for all things Claremont, Florida and Central Florida. It's got news, it's got real estate news, it's got county events, community events, city events. We go through houses, neighborhoods, we go into the restaurants. Guys, go like that, go to that channel. If you like it, hit subscribe and the bell. Just so you know, there is not, as of 8, 17, 20, 23, there's not one guru, and I can name them, I love them, that has just taught you how to increase your subscriber base on your YouTube channel by simply emailing the most targeted leads in your area because you're going to get their emails, right? And sending a video to them on Facebook at four pennies a click to drive them to your YouTube channel. Because here's what I know. The more subscribers you get to your YouTube channel, the higher your videos will uh, pop to the top. Those inbound calls, when you get them, they're gold. They're even better than referrals because they're calling you. Let's let's wrap this up now back into direct mail. So what did I just show you guys? I showed you a direct mail platform that will automate all of your direct mail. If you decide to pull the trigger, look below. I've got the, uh, the special offer that they're offering. When you get it, you're going to get my training. You're going to get the onboarding. You're going to get all my cards, my video scripts for the cards, everything wrapped up in one big bundle for you. Go to My Plus Ninja. I'll leave the link below. Get your 30-day free trial. And once the trial's over, if you convert over, you're going to get access to just literally thousands of leads a month in your geo farm with all the contact information. It doesn't get any better than that, right? So again, if you're going to be dominating for the rest of the year, if you are currently spending money right now, right now on things that are not working, I adjure you. I, I'm not going to beg you. I'm asking you, go look at what you're spending right now. And if you're either, one, not using it correctly, go use it correctly. But if you're using it and it's not working, get rid of it. You need to concentrate, in my humble opinion, on direct mail, targeted postcards, targeted education-based postcards, video-dominating postcards, number one. Number two, get your YouTube channel up today. Follow this channel, subscribe, and hit the bell. I'm going to train you on these things, guys. We're also going to talk about Facebook ads, Google pay-per-click ads. We're going to talk about correct way to do open houses, how to find leads. We're, all of that's on this channel. But I want to give you what I call the no BS marketing strategies, guys, that work. My my uh, YouTube channel here for my local farm, I just started about six months ago. I'm almost at 700 subscribers, thousands of views, millions of dollars sold already in real estate, and millions on the books, and a bunch of people waiting to come down, which is more millions. And that's only in six months. And not one of those people I went after, they came after me.
Same thing with your targeted postcards. They're going to come after you. If that doesn't incite, excite you, guys, I, I don't know what else. I mean, I'm, I'm as transparent as I can be. I'm as transparent as I can be. I've done it in 15 years. I've done it all. Um, I've done a lot of it. I haven't, nobody's done it all. I've done a lot of it. So I, I know a thing or two about what works and what doesn't. Um, but again, there you go. This video is dedicated to the topic of this ain't your grandma's postcard campaigns. Guys, automate it, send it to the right leads, and then make sure your message is on point that you're doing the video uh, marketing on your cards and things are going to happen. And how cool is it for you to start getting emails and texts that somebody scans your cards? Right? I could go on. I'm done. This is the, this is the video for today. Let me know what you think. Did you think this was complete BS? Or you're like, oh my God, Kelly, you talked about this before. I mean, I want to hear your comments. What is it you want to be trained on? What are some topics you guys are interested in? I'm not guaranteed I'm going to do it, especially if it's BS, but at least I'll look at it. If I see value in it, I'll I'll get into it, learn it, and then we'll bring it back here and dispense the knowledge to you. All right, guys, that's it. You know the drill. Subscribe, the bell, go below, get your get the links to get your specials. If you decide to go with the postcard that I'm using, you get all of my stuff. Um, Definitely get your My Plus Leads free trial, guys. I mean, leads on demand. Holy crap. It's going to change your life. All right, that's it, guys. I am done. Pray for me that the AC guy gets here in the next hour because I just dropped three pounds of sweat on this video, guys. I um, appreciate every one of you Ninja Maniacs. And until we talk again or you see me on the next video, be prosperous and go get you some closings.